getting fit in business. What's it going to take? I'm telling you, as you know, I'm working on my exit strategy and my retirement and what my fifth gear is going to be, which is always going to be helping people. Uh, as I finish up 2023, I've learned a lot about mental illness in business transactions. And why do I bring this up? Because it's happening. I'm actually shocked that I have to educate myself on narcissism, uh, obsessive compulsion, dysfunction, OCD. It's actually happening. And we're at the finish line, man. We're at the finish line. And if I'm going to have any recommendations for taking on clients, is you need to understand their history, their background, especially sellers, the trauma that they've had, their family's involvement, especially in succession. There's a lot going on, man. And I'm one of 11 children and fantastic parents, and I could just imagine what they had to go through, especially with me. So I just wanted to remind you, today's message is about mental illness and how serious it is with successful people because it could be a, a disaster for the future. And then you're dealing with very, very smart people on the buy side that just don't understand what I call the wild horses. It's very difficult to tame a wild horse and to train them and to help them through an M&A transaction. So I just wanted to bring this to your attention that I'm seeing it more and more, especially under these distressed times, these economic times that are uncertain and very, very difficult for the small guy. And what I mean by the small guy is I'm talking about under 100 million in sales. That's, that's serious, man. That's serious. So once again, check me out, rocklamana.com. And uh, you have my book. It'll be linked here. And what I went through, the trauma I went through, and how I succeeded through it with the help of professional assistance. So once again, Rock Lamana could always call me. If you got an issue, let's talk about it. Startups, entrepreneurs, and potential sellers, those are primary clients that we talk to about their mental illness and their mental health in the family or with themselves. So God bless. I'll see you soon.